today, but was. then we got some rain. The rain came and the temp <laughs> dropped about 20 degrees. Wasn't that nice? Yeah, nice, very nice. Yeah. yeah, and even if it didn't rain a lot in your neighborhood, it did cool down, that's for sure. We had some rain here, uh, and we also had some rain on the west side of town. Gabby Coons from over in Peoria sent us this video from when the rain really kind of moved in during the late afternoon and evening hours. It didn't get over here into central Phoenix until about 7, 8 o'clock tonight. Most of that light to moderate rain, though, has moved on, although you still could see some lingering showers out there in the overnight hours. Yeah, there's that 100 degree reading that we got to before the rain. 95 is uh, average. Right now at Sky Harbor Airport, we're down to 81. The air is calm. The dew points popped up to 57 degrees. No much of a rain at the airport yet. We're going to keep checking to see if they've gotten any, but they haven't had any so far. Now, 900s in downtown Phoenix. We put that on our plot. A lot of locations didn't get any rain, but uh, about 13% uh, of the rain gauges, according to the weather service around town, did. And they include one of the bigger ones, two tenths of an inch of rain up at Peoria, 1200s for Whitman, and we had one hundredth of an inch of rain at Gilbert. So that's the very least amount you can get to tip over a rain gauge or make the button tip in it and give it a reading. Here go the showers. They're headed to the south of town right now. And again, we might see a few more pop up during the rest of the overnight hours, but the heaviest storms have now matriculated into portions of Pima County out to the west of Tucson. So even Tucson, which saw some rain today, we're going to see a little bit of rain tonight. Won't see any heavy thunderstorms, but we still have a few isolated showers in northern Arizona that could impact us in the overnight hours. So let's take us through the overnight hours. By tomorrow morning, we're going to have still mostly cloudy skies around Metro Phoenix. Then as we get into the afternoon hours, well, it looks like we've got some storms trying to make a run. They may or may not make it into the valley as today. We found out that many areas didn't get them, but those showers will generally be active through about midnight tomorrow. Then as we get into Saturday, kind of a little bit of a different change in the weather pattern. We're still going to see isolated storms in northern and eastern Arizona, but our chances in the valley seem to be going down a little bit, even though they've never been really high this week. They're going to go down a little bit. So a few showers still possible tonight, low of about 76. Tomorrow we could get some afternoon storms again with a high of about 97. But then we're going to take it out of the forecast for a bit. We're going to start warming things up by the end of the weekend. Sunday afternoon should be around 100 degrees. Looks good, Boyle. Thanks.